hello guys hope you're doing well so if you are getting this kind of error boot device not found and you can see the hard disk error code 3f0 if you are facing any kind of boot related issues with your laptop in this video we are going to fix this issue first turn off your laptop press and hold the power key and shut down your laptop now remove if you are using any kind of uh, usb storage in your laptop so i will remove this usb pen drive and if you are using any kind of sd card remove that sd card as well so remove everything from your pen drive now open the hardware diagnostic mode in hp laptop you can use this f2 key to run the diagnostic mode i will show you how to do it turn on your laptop and within a second start pressing this f2 key so this is the diagnostic mode in hp laptop now you have to select the second option hardware a device check hardware drive check select this option then press center you have two options i uh, will go for quick check so this will check your hard drive wait for few seconds and you can see the smart check is passed so there is no hardware issue uh, with my uh, laptop so this is your step 1 check your hard drive now move on to a next step press and hold the power key again and shut down your laptop now you have to open the bios menu so in hp laptop you can use this skip key or you can use this f10 key to open the bios menu i will show you how to do it turn on your laptop and within a second start pressing this f10 key so now you can see this is the bios menu in hp laptop now go uh, click on this option advance so i will use my touchpad mouse click on advance then click on this boot options okay now scroll down scroll down and now select the legacy boot order tick this option okay select the legacy boot order then click on save so this will save the changes then click on yes now go back to the main menu click on the main option then select this option save changes and exit then click on yes now your laptop will restart uh, wait for a few seconds so first you have to remove all type of storage uh, which are connected with your laptop then run the hardware diagnostic mode and after that check the bios menu and select the legacy mode in your bios menu so now wait and we are going to check if and you can see the issue has been fixed now my windows is booting so this is all for the video thank you